Motionless puppets crossed by the flow of time. We are choiceless rotters, consumed by the crawling of events. The irony of fate, I had just ceased to exist, and the most important choice of my life was one click away from me. Mr. Evan Kapnos, identity implant KPN4722. The owner of your identity debt, as well as your employer, Securitech Inc., went bankrupt. Hence, I had to personally authorize the foreclosure of your identity. You are in a stalemate, Mr. Kapnos. Until the auctioning, your ID is going to be suspended. Mental bollards will prevent you from leaving the city. Identity of your interlocutors will be censored. Your access to the blockchain will stay disabled. Your service weapon has been disassociated from your ID. As the protocol imposes, you are required to reach the court within 4 p.m. on today's date. Beyond that term, I will be compelled to consider you as non-compliant. Have a nice day, Mr. Kapnos. I definitely needed to wear some clothes and quickly reach the court. It wasn't my best day so far, but it was still pretty early. There was plenty of time to make things worse. He's coming. It's time to run. crowded out here okay listen I know you have a lot of questions but I need you to trust me there's a small cover right in front of the door stay down and come out slowly okay I can see you again there is a blind spot under that big turbine try to reach it while I look for a way out
Okay, now, reach the lower floor moving into the shaft. Find a safe spot, and I'll be there with a car in minutes. Oh, it's possible something weird may happen with your implants. Something weird may happen with your implants. It was already happening, affecting my whole life. I had never seen something like that. My implants were literally learning from my experiences. I'm picking up your position. I'll try to move closer. Capnos, right? Glad to see you're still alive. Listen, we are under a certain amount of time pressure, but I think I owe you some explanation. I'll have to be quick, so is there anything specific you'd like to know before we move forward? In the Circuit Tech Laboratories, there's a weapon built to connect and extend the potential of your implants. If we get it back, it will be a lot easier to stay alive while we understand who's behind all of this. That's exactly what we are doing. I just have to find a safe spot for landing. Let me check. Something is not working here. I'm locked out from the Circuit Tech surveillance system. Uh, your firmware should be able to connect from the distance. Can you bypass the access to the cameras from here? Well done. That's my office. From there, we will have a quick access to the laboratories. And it seems we are not alone. Check if the rooftop is safe. I need you to send me the coordinates of the car park. Received. We'll land there in a few seconds. at SecureTech, that was the first time I set foot in the administration building. That was a weird way to reach the high places.
Did you manage to reach the laboratory? The weapon is at the shooting range, Sector 2. Alex Keyclose. That name popped up way too often not to be suspicious. I just got notified by the calibration program. Seems you're on the right path. I'll be waiting for you on the rooftop. Keep a low profile coming upstairs. Suddenly, my implants were picking up a signal. Where was it coming from? The interference was very close. 
I just had to look around. I had no idea what it was, but apparently my implants did. access to the surveillance system, but I managed to unlock the elevator to the rooftop. Be quick. I think I know who's responsible for all of this.
terminal was disconnected, but there was still a chance I could restore the internal network. up with a new weapon and a unique interpretation of low profile reaching the court alive finally felt like an option okay after your infiltration i could restore my access to the surveillance system i think i know who's trying to kill you exactly seems you can confirm my suspicions I found several access attempts from his account. He must be in a real hurry to leave so many evident traces. <sighs> Long story. Kiklos is one of the few rich people who could buy back his ID debt from the state. He is also the head of an investment fund, the Kiklos Foundation. I funded Circotet thanks to his money, but I kept control over production and the secret experimental program you already know. The experimental program is the only reason that convinced Alex to invest. Despite being legally compromising, modified implants can pull some serious money. But after the bankruptcy, the experimental program could come out. Getting rid of all the evidence of the program will cost him a lot less than being discovered. Kiklos is a free man in our system. I'm not that lucky, but my expertise could settle my debt. If only I can keep the experimentation going. You are all that's left of my work, and our lives depend on each other. I see your frustration, but it's not a matter of what we want. If we don't stop Kiklos, we will both lose everything. My information said he is now at the office in one of his nightclubs, the Lusuoso Club. He's not expecting visitors. We have to stop him there. That's exactly what we are doing. like someone was using the electricity grids to communicate outside of the blockchain. Sounds perfect for someone who's got something to hide.
Miklos's office is accessible from the VIP area in the dance floor. I'm sending you the coordinates.
Now move, or I'll shoot! He was behind me. But the worst thing... ...was that I needed him... ...alive. I had to get him talking. Okay, okay, please calm down! Whatever they pay you, I can give you more! What are you talking about? You already killed my secure tech employees, and now the club staff! Really, tell me what you want. I'm sure we can find a deal. Ah, okay. Listen. I'm sorry for the implant experimentation and all, but there's something bigger going on here. What names? I can give you names. Dahlia Kauri, look for her. Believe me, killing you would be absolutely counterproductive for me. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, okay, wait. I can explain. But this whole thing has gotten way out of hand. I led Secure Tech to bankruptcy doing some stuff with our providers. I just wanted to buy the company back at the auction, and keep Kari out of the game. You see now, it makes no sense to kill you or your colleagues. I need to find that out too. Those people are also all over me. Why do you think I'm barricaded in here? <laughs> Those are the guys! Those are the guys I was talking about! 